Welcome to Command Roasters. Um, today I just want to quickly show you how the ignition system works and how to control your um, gas flow on the Command Roaster. So to, to start, um, I'm just going to switch the air on. So we've got air drawn through the roaster. You don't want to start your gas without the airflow being on and I put it at about 6 volt. Right, so to do the ignition, we push down on the dial, we turn anti-clockwise to the 9 o'clock position, and you'll hear the click, there goes the ignition, and your roaster is going. So what I'm going to do here now, I'm going to show you, you're on 50 millibar, and if you turn it anti-clockwise down to about the 6 o'clock position, you will see your gauge come down to about 20 millibar. It varies on different roasters, it'll sometimes, and also the ambient temperature, 18 to 22 is around about what you're looking at there. I turn it back towards the 9 o'clock position for full temperature. And then if you very slowly turn it back, and you can actually see this gauge, or this, this kind of symbol here shows you that. If you slowly turn it back towards the 12 o'clock position, you can control your gas flow and you can set it a different and you can bring it all the way down to about 5 millibar you can come back up to 30 35, 40 it takes a bit of practice but it's quite easy then you die and it will run on 5 millibar and to switch it off just bring it back up to the top Thank you for watching um, the video and please subscribe to the channel.